Replacement of mechanical chime doorbell with Google Nest, wired. Before installation make sure that doorbell transformer has proper voltage. Standard mechanical chime doorbell is powered by 16 to 24 volt AC and 10 to 40 VA, power, doorbell transformer. Typical doorbell transformer with two terminals. Transformer is usually located near electric panel box, unfinished basement or utility room. Transformers are typically labeled with a voltage rating, molded or etched into the transformer's body. If there is no label, using voltmeter, multimeter, measure the transformer voltage on transformer's terminals or in the chime before installation. Measure between terminals. Voltmeter should read voltage between 16 and 24 volt AC. Voltage can also be read in the chime. Chime is easy to find when you push the doorbell button, you hear it. Very often. Cables from push buttons and transformer are spliced at a chime point. Remove chime cover. Typical mechanical chime wiring. Back door push button cable. Front door push button cable. Cable from transformer. Splicing point. At a chime point, measure the voltage between splicing point and a chime terminal marked transformer or TR. Voltmeter should read voltage between 16 and 24 volts AC. If there is no visible splicing point, Measure the voltage between transformer terminal and front terminal while front door push button is pressed. Voltage can be also read between transformer terminal and back terminal while pressing the back door doorbell push button. When is only front door push button installed? Only two terminals of chime are used. If the voltage of existing doorbell system is compatible with Nest, new doorbell can be installed. Nest doorbell package box contains Doorbell camera unit, wired Wall plate Wall plate wedge Chime connector Installation parts box Unlock tool Wire extenders Setup instruction Scan QR code from device or follow setup instruction attached. Disconnect the power to the doorbell by turning breaker off or disconnecting, removing, wires from transformer's terminals. Chime connector installation. Remove chime decorative cover. Remove wire from front terminal. Chime connector. Chime connector wire with loops. Chime connector wire with quick connectors. Terminate white connector wire with loop to the chime front terminal. Remove wire from transformer terminal. Terminate gray connector wire with loop to the chime transformer terminal. Terminate white connector wire with quick connector to the wire removed from front terminal of the chime. Terminate gray connector wire with quick connector to the wire removed from transformer terminal of the chime. Attach chime connector to the side of chime or other place where it fit, can also be placed outside of doorbell cover. Place wiring in way that not touching any movable part of the doorbell during the ring. Reinstall chime cover. Replace doorbell push button with nest camera. Remove push button screws. Carefully pull the doorbell button away from the door frame far as it is possible. Remove the wires from the push button. Wires need to be long enough to install new doorbell camera. If wires are too short, must be extended by wire extenders or other way. Sometimes cable must be replaced. Choose when camera will cover area of your choice when installed, with wall plate only or wall plate with wall plate wedge. Wall plate. 
wall plate wedge. In this installation both wall plates will be used because side wall is blocking side viewing area. Install wall plate with wall plate wedge to the door molding. Make sure that the wall plate is installed plumb. Wall plate wedge is installed under the wall plate. Nest cameras wire termination screws. Trim the wires as needed. Strip the insulation from the ends of the wires about one half of inch, and make loops on the ends of this wires. Terminate one of the wires to any of the camera termination screw. Terminate other wire to second camera termination screw. To avoid wire damage, slide wire back to its hole, or hide it between wall plate and wall plate wedge. On flat surface, when only wall plate is installed, any opening, notch, can be made under the wall plate to hide cable, when sliding it back to cable hole is not possible. To attach camera, slide the camera top, match groove on the wall plate and niche on the camera unit, on the wall plate and press down until it clicks into the place. To remove camera from wall plate, use the tool to release it. Release tool. Insert into the hole to release camera. Restore power to the doorbell. If this video is helpful please subscribe. Comments are welcome.